you want me to put this on auto? Focus on Yeah, this? keep it on auto okay. for right now. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. I zoom out a little bit so you get a kind of a wide shot of the uh, of the tripod. Yeah. Sure. Have fun. <laughs> okay. Uh, today we're going to be setting up a tripod and a uh, camcorder. So uh, first thing you want to do is um, you want to spread the legs out. You can see them, and uh, this is the way the tripod will come. All compact. Uh, and the next thing you want to do is open up the legs. So get the legs spread out. Uh, you want to get the, uh, the head of the tripod. These are the sticks or the legs. Uh, the top part that you mount the camera on is called the head. Um, you want to tighten up the legs once you get them open. Um, I will. <laughs> Checking the level. Uh, Brenda, um, you want to come around, you can get a, a tight shot of some of this. No, it's okay, because this is all going to be edited. Can you see? Can you zoom in on the, uh, on the level? On the level? What you want to do is... It's a little blurry, though. How do you like... Uh, put, try putting it in manual. Right. And focusing it yourself. Okay, now I just turn it. Mm -hmm. Turn the outer ring. And you want to focus right in on the level. Maybe back up a little bit. Okay. Oh, I, I, I got it. All right. All right, and you want to have the, um, I don't know if you can see it, but you want to have the little bubble in the middle of the level. And that's pretty close. That's pretty much in there. Okay, uh, you have several other adjustments on the, uh, on the head of the tripod. This uh, lever here uh, controls your pedestal, and it has a little catch. And if you swing it around on the other side, you'll notice uh, this is your level, uh, your uh, pedestal lock. So to bring the pedestal up, you loosen up the, the pedestal lock, and then you can raise or lower the tripod with the, with the pedestal turn. There's also uh, another catch over here that holds on to the teeth that keeps the, uh, that's just another safety precaution, so you don't have to use the uh, lock all the time. If you want to put it down, you press down on the lock and turn the lever. Okay. Also over here, some more adjustments. Um, this is your pan lock. You want to loosen that up to turn back and forth. Um, this on the side of your camera arm is the arm lock. And you turn that, you can bring your arm up a position where it's comfortable for you to use with the camcorder. And you can swim that around. Also, we have our, uh, this is our tilt drag control on this side. All right. Now we're ready to mount the camera. And step on the microphone wire. Now we're ready to step on the microphone wire. Once completing all of this, we're ready to step on the microphone. <clears throat> okay, this piece right here is uh, the camera plate. This is what mounts the camera on top of the tripod. Um, there's a double screw here, and if you can see into the, if you can see into the bottom. And there's a, there's a place for the screw to fit in and a place for the camera plate to lock onto. And 
This is where you'd be screwing the camera in, and this is the lock. So you place this on here, find the screw hole. But when we edit this together, this is going to look slick. <laughs> That's what that's what editing's for. No, this is good. Okay. Okay. Now the camera plate's on. With that one simple gesture, we put the camera plate on. Uh, and if you come over here to the tripod, you can see uh, there's a there's a lock, a locking system to lock the camera onto the tripod. Uh, it's got a button. Uh, when you put the camera, the, the camera plate onto the tripod, locks the, uh, turns this mechanism around and locks the camera into place. Um, you want to point the camera. You want to point the camera in the direction opposite of the arm that you're holding. So that the camera is going this way into the front. And you mount the camera right onto the tripod, and the locking arm swings over. Then you're all set to go. Um, you want to check and make sure that your um, camera's locked down before you do any shooting. And now you're ready to start using your camcorder. And I didn't bring a battery, so I'll have to use the power supply. The power supply comes with lots and lots of wires, as you can see. This is your HD current, plugs uh, right into any ordinary household uh, alternate current uh, socket, and you can just plug that in. <laughs> <laughs> and you can see that's plugged in very securely. And uh, this fits right onto, let me swing this over so you can see. This fits right over onto the jack in the back of the camcorder. Um, and your video and audio signals, uh, as well as your uh, power supply, travel right through this one cord. And that fits right onto the back. And then you load your tape. Take your lens cap off. And you're set to go. It's as easy as that. Bye-bye. Wow. <laughs>